Well, what's up everyone? Today we are starting up a new first person shooter on Xbox 360 Syndicate. And I actually, because I got the game new, I actually have that code, I forget what it's called. But it pretty much gives me some weapon skins and all that right off the bat. You know, the obviously you don't like stupid little ploy to get the game new instead of renting it. And today if my, you know, if I can't speak, I got water here for just in case. Very nice. Take a sip here before we start. Ah, now I'm playing this on the Xbox 360. I actually haven't had a chance to comment on the new dashboard. There was kind of a, when they finally applied the dashboard, there was nothing else to play on 360. It was pretty much the end of the gaming year, so I couldn't mention it, and I haven't played anything on Xbox since uh, to do a playthrough anyway. So, the mention is, what I pretty much have to mention about it is, it's very different, it's very... Very different, pretty much, and I don't mind it so much. I still like the original design of the first Xbox 360, the original dashboard, not the white one, not the second one, the first one. Um, but this is not bad. It's very different. I kind of like it. You know, they've applied YouTube and all this other uh, cool stuff, so it's okay. I think it's all right. Let's start it up. Kind of wanted to share my thoughts on it because I know I haven't mentioned anything about it. Supposed to be a unique first person shooter. I'll be the judge of that. Yeah, you said the same thing about Homefront. I got my worst game of 2011. <laughs> and I'm trying a new C mode, like, I think it's called Twilight or something. And I hate having to use uh, something that says that, that's called Twilight, but I have to. So far from the start, it's giving off a bluish tint, which I'm not a fan of, but. I started up. Still trying to work everything out with this new camera. This title uses an auto auto save feature. Really? Wow. Yes. Take more of my hard drive space. Thank you very much, game. There right, we we'll go. Options. Subtitles. We'll turn it on so everybody can hear everything. Uh, gamma. Pump up the gamma. That's way too bright. That's way too dark. I'd say about there's good. Blackness level, really. Yeah. That looks good, actually. We'll just go with that. Yeah, I guess that's fine. All right, let's just go. Campaign. New game. Easy, normal, or hard. I have a feeling, now, don't judge me, since there's only three difficulties, okay? I think I'm just gonna go with easy, because if this is the type of game that's like a Battlefield campaign, where it's it just gets hard for no reason, then I think I'm gonna just go with easy, okay? Now, I'm actually gonna look. Is there achievement? <sighs> if there's an achievement... Yeah, there are achievements for beating it on normal. Seems like there's no achievements for beating it on easy. Well, then I will go on normal. I, I probably will regret it, but I'll do normal. Screw it. If I get an extra achievement, I might as well... 1993, 99, 2000, uh. In the year 2017, the world's largest corporate merger leads to the creation of Eurocorp. The company is the first to spearhead the development of a biodigital implant, the dark chip. Fueled by adrenaline, its users experience unsurpassed connectivity with the Dataverse, rendering all digital devices obsolete. Used mainly for a sex tool. In a world dominated by these massive corporations. Created by Oprah Winfrey. The population swells to 15 billion. 57% are chipped and linked to their preferred corporation. The rest are digitally locked out. Out of sight and out of like Tom Cruise. <laughs> Industrial espionage reaches unparalleled heights. Covert agents are mobilized to protect and serve their interests. You are one of the chosen few. I am the chosen one. 
I look like a generic idiot. Welcome to Syndicate. Home of the generic idiot. <laughs> Produced by Ryan Seacrest. <laughs> New York, 2069. New York Eve 3. This time with all the movie stars in the world. We bring you Syndicate. <laughs> <laughs> Press A to start. Jeez, what happened to the bottle I'm drinking from? <laughs> oh man, this is starting just like Homefront, oh no. Yeah, I'm gonna switch the scene mode in a minute. I don't know, it looks alright. Roger that HQ, we'll begin wake-up procedure. S by slapping him. Oh, see? I told you. Okay. Time to wake up. I was right, I called it. Ow, stop punching me, you jerk. Ow. Welcome to Chip System. Welcome to Chip System. Let's break out all your teeth. Hey, are you in there? Yeah, I am. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, but the truth is... Oh, Mash X? What's this? Oh. Oh, yeah. Super strength. Oh, uh, the truth is, though, no one wins with a headbutt. Ow. That's right, the subject is operational. Okay, pretty much the same controls as, like, a Call of Duty. Hold it. The mash. It's just complicated controls, man. Oh crap. That's not good. How do you crouch, dude? Oh, I don't want to do that. Oh. What are you doing? Oh, we're hacking it? What the hell's going on? Oh, it's going away. I was just thinking that I need to crouch. It kind of seems like a place I'll, I'll crouch through. A beast crouch, okay. It is, it is a place I need to crouch through. Pretty cool, actually. Nice. Detecting structural weakness. Recommended brute force assault. Oh! Boom! That was sweet. That was some born identity crap right there. Oh man, that was cool. You got nothing on Matt Damon. Give me that pistol. <laughs> None on Matt Damon. Uh. Oh. Hey, what you doing? What the hell? Execute? Why would I execute him? Ooh! Personal log. Whatever, I don't care. It's like I don't read any of this crap in Skyrim, why would I read it here? 
This looks like a trap. Exit is closed. Local power grid is offline. Reroute the pop the power. It's got kind of like that shaky camera aspect. Power grid governor detected in this vicinity. Ooh, that was sweet. I like the execution so far. Isn't that where the power is? Oh, over here. Cool.